I'm so tired. <laughs> friends it is actually 6 a.m for me right now but i lied i lied it's now 7 15 <laughs> but um today's gonna be a great day because first of all it is friday and secondly i'm actually going in the office today and i'm actually very very excited because i never really go in on a friday if you are new to the channel you probably don't know what's going on but i started full time in london and i'm just i only have to go in there two days a week another reason why it's gonna be a good day is because i have a new outfit on and <laughs> i don't know about you but when you have a new outfit on you just you just feel confidence in you so i got myself a very it's a very basic outfit but i thought i'd just quickly show you my or Zara top. I have this in green and then I also got some new blue jeans. They don't look any different from my old ones but basically I they don't fit me very nicely anymore. They're too baggy so I wanted to get a slight a bit of better size for me now. Um, I'm just going to do my to do is because it makes me feel way more organised towards the day so what have I got to do today? There's so much on the agenda. Um, one thing I'm really looking forward to is I literally cannot wait. I'm going to go to this really nice bakery. It's called Gal's Bakery. I'm going to get myself an almond croissant and a oat latte. I'm back from work it's actually half five we finished early on a friday so i'm just taking advantage of it i'm gonna go for a run now and i can't wait because it's like sunset time but apart from that um i had such a good day today i got um obviously you saw that i got my almond croissant day was made from that i know it's so cliche to say but if you can really just go on those like self dates for yourself because like it's so important like i feel way better that i did that today for myself and you know took myself out <laughs> you know do things that make you feel alive and makes you feel like the main character away um i know cliche to say but yeah i also had a few little shout outs at work and feel very whole I look like a pee <laughs> hey <laughs> five miles done <laughs> That was so awkward. I don't know why I say it like that. I guess this is literally a self-care vlog. <laughs> I've just come to realise that's what it is. But yeah, see you tomorrow. Hey guys, hey guys, book here I am. Woo. <laughs> Happy Saturday. <laughs> Say hi, Abs. Have you, you said hello? Have you said hello? <laughs> it's saturday morning and it's gonna be a good day um it's a proper full day so i thought i'd just get some starbucks oh we've got a big bee oh mm. open the door i've got mm. that one there oh it's had a massive bee right okay i should try something new i got an ice carrot what is going on with me so <laughs> free take i actually got something different i got an iced cappuccino with a cinnamon syrup and soy milk so that'd be interesting because i really want to try like sweet cream foam but they don't really do it in the uk so i'm just trying to work out what i can do um and i also picked up some brown sugar because i want to try the brown sugar coffee at home i'm going to try mine now because i'm intrigued it's not going to be any different but mm, that's delicious so do you want to try it no is it not a bit of you <laughs> Oh, see ya! Mmm! Hey guys! It is time to do some editing. Literally my favourite part of the day is going for a little dog walk. You can't see the magic. Wow! Let's go. Happy Sunday. I look like a little lad right now and I was to get my hair highlighted again. But Berries and cream. right now I'm going to work out. I feel like I haven't recorded like a workout in my videos for so long. So I really enjoy having them in the vlogs and it's just nice for me to look at my fitness journey. I don't know. And my mum and dad actually cleaned all this out yesterday. So it's all like clean and there's just way more room to do everything so i feel even more motivated and what i hear from you guys you find them really motivating and it's just fun for me because i have such a passion for fitness with all that being said i'm going to do a bit of functional training today so i actually started this program not really i'm literally just doing it whenever i need a bit of inspo but she's actually created an ebook called healthy hot girls and this includes tons of workouts so that's what i've been doing at the moment where are my headphones Oh, no. I'll show you what my mum and dad have done, actually. So, yeah, this is the new setup. So, instead of the running machine being over there, the desk is now there. And, you know, the weights are there. The weights are in the wardrobe. Yeah, it just looks way better. I have way more room. And um, I probably will be filming my podcast out here as well. So, that'd be even better. Oh, jeez, Louise. Oh, yeah. Also, 
so my workout routine has changed. I pretty work out about three to four times a week. I used to work out like, basically it was hard for me to take a rest day. Um, but obviously as I've started work, it's hard to keep up with that. But I'm also glad that it happened because I was going a little bit too hardcore, I think. But because I enjoyed it so much. <laughs> if anyone cares, I'm not like a fitness guru. <laughs> anyway, back to this. Oh, oh, that's a hair Yeah. What the? Is that this way? It's not plugged in. I don't think it's plugged in. Can you hear the rain outside? Crumpet or toast? I'm so indecisive, but and look at these. Look how big they are. I've never seen a crumpet this big in my life. I also want to show you my trousers I didn't show you the other day, but basically they are way too long. It's also raining outside, so I'm scared it's gonna like ruin my trousers, but I want to wear them today. Can you see that? I'm gonna try it and walk over the bridge after work today because like there's so much to explore in London and I feel like I have a bit of a zest to go and find a little bit more and explore a little bit. Oh my goodness gracious me. It's literally just me right now in. Look, can you can you see that? So bad, so bad. I need to get some tape because this is embarrassing. I was literally looking up hacks how to like shorten your trousers <laughs> in an emergency situation, but obviously I need a hem or like I need some tape. What's really sad about this is that I was so excited to wear these trousers and now <laughs> take them off, <laughs> take them off. You learn from your mistakes, don't you? <laughs> and I actually have tears in my eyes because mum, the beautiful person she is, she's done my bedroom for me. Let me show you, it looks so good. It's literally been a state for the longest time and just haven't had any time to clean it and it just looks so good. What a great day, you've made my whole day. <laughs> Hi, um, well, we all good? Are we good camera? Oh. So it is the next day. I just had a little shift with my old work. Just helping them out because they're really busy at the moment and they need the help. Yeah, and I actually got my little good luck card and I got a little little necklace as well. How cute. It literally brought me so much joy. So I'm just so grateful for that. And I also got myself a protein bar at Taylor Woods. <laughs> we are obsessed with these. But now the reason I'm actually filming is because I'm gonna go get a massage done. A little self-care moment. I know everyone moans about their back, but I'm here to say <laughs> mine is terrible. Yeah, like I actually want someone to hurt me. Like I don't want just like a little massage. Like I <laughs> <laughs> I want the full thing. I want to come out like aching. So it's a great day. I'll see you in a bit. I really want to do another full playlist soon. So let me know if you want to see that. But anyway, go and do some grown up food shopping. I'm not going grown up food shopping. I'm literally going to go and get myself some sweets for Halloween. So <laughs> it's baby steps, you know. It's actually really hot today, but I want to wear my hat <laughs> because I'm obsessed with it. You have to fan and when things are really tough and they're really rough and nothing's working but there's something inside of you that says i just have to follow that oh my gosh what a good day like <laughs> i'm gonna go out with myself more often because i just have the best time i don't know why i was so nervous to do it before someone's looking at me right now filming but i'm just gonna carry on filming I've got a latte a latte for me and my mom yeah look how cute that is i love that of course after the massage i went food shopping after and it was so sweet because i thought you know it's actually november now where they do the poppy pill i was walking out the shop and i was like oh my god i forgot to do the poppy thing i might as well do it now so i went back and i spoke to this lady who was doing it because i only had a pound but she gave me like the nice like the nicer poppy how sweet like i literally could have cried in that moment i could still cry now but the massage was so good as well the lady was so nice her name was Susie. so so shout out to Susie. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna go home now and I actually need to tell you about what I did yesterday because I just filmed loads and never actually explained what I did So I did it in a minute because I don't want my coffee to go cold, but I've seen a bit It's been a good day and I feel so grateful. Ooh. I feel so happy <laughs> I needed this water so badly. But yeah relating back to yesterday as I was saying after work I had the vision to go out and explore around London find a really nice coffee shop Which I didn't but I found something way better. I went out with my work friends We went to the pub and then after that I literally just went for like an hour I've never actually been to the pub. <laughs> and then after that as you saw I did a bit of exploring in London um, Literally just Tower Hill. I was like trying to find a really cute like trendy coffee shop First of all I went to Starbucks and it was a really nice Starbucks But they were taking too long and I had no offense to the people 
working there, but I just I had a time crunch. And then I was like, I'm gonna keep going towards the station, see if there's any other coffee shops nearby. Saw another one, went in there, as you saw. No luck. Keep walking up. <laughs> I saw another one, and like, they just cleaned the coffee machine. So I was like, no, it's fine, I'll go. So I didn't know that began the coffee. But <laughs> also, as I was just saying that, like, you know, being grateful and really being present, I wasn't that present as I thought I wanted to be. I was putting so much pressure on it. Like, because I put this expectation of how I saw my evening, I was still like in a different world. But then when I got home, I was just about to go to sleep and then I had my little reflection of the day and I was like, wow, I literally walked all those steps. I had the independence, I had the freedom to go out and I was safe. My sister, she would have loved to have gone and done that, you know, walked all those steps. And it just put things into perspective again for me. And then I did a gratitude meditation and I felt great. So, but yeah, so it's literally about going back to that. You have to practice daily appreciation and gratitude. And even though you may feel silly for listing things that you're grateful for, you have to do it consistently for you to really be present in what's going on because that is like the key to happiness and joy. So we all know that we're very privileged and lucky where we are, but we always need to remind ourselves on why that is. But yeah, that's my little TED talk over. I'm actually gonna chill out for the evening now. I can't wait. But yeah, thanks so much for hanging out with me. I had such a great time with you. I hope you had a great time with me. Be kind as you can be kind. I'll see you very soon with another video. Bye. <laughs> I also want to give you my little experience on the massage. So, it was great. It was so good. But at the end, because it's like a tie play to do a lot of like stretches of you at the end. And guys, I had my top off. <laughs> And I felt uncomfy. But the lady was so nice that she didn't make me feel uncomfortable at all. But in my head, I was thinking, oh my gosh, <laughs> I'm naked. <laughs> How we all feeling out there? <laughs>